What's up, what's up, what's up? It's T-Walk Talk. Today's topic, I'm going to give y'all my personal opinion on how often you should train a specific body part and muscle group. So make sure y'all watch all the way to the end to see my answer. And make sure y'all go ahead and click that subscribe button. Now let's get right into it. T-Walk, hit the battlefield and go berserk. 20-inch arms pumping iron till you know it hurt. He looking like he probably fresh out the pen. But nah, he just consistent, young and fresh off the gym. So like I said, this is my personal opinion. So how often should you train a specific muscle group? I would say it depends on you, your specific goal, where you're at, what you're looking to achieve. So I wouldn't say there's one answer. Yeah, the scientists and all of them are gonna say only train certain muscle group one time a week. Some scientists are gonna say only train a muscle group two times a week. So who's right? I'm gonna give y'all my opinion. For me, I wanted big arms. Y'all heard me say this in the past. I was training arms five times a week. That's just what I was doing. So yeah, your wrist overtraining. So again, it depends on your mentality, uh, how you're looking to go about it. With me, I didn't care. There was points where my arm was sore. Uh, I couldn't move it. It probably had a slight injury, but I was still pumping out five times a week. Now, of course, you gotta mess with the volumes, with the reps, the sets. So one day I might go extra heavy. The other day I'm going extra light, high reps. Other days I'm just going in to get a quick pump, so switching it up. You can't go five times a week, hit your arms every single day, high reps, high sets, pushing the weights, drop sets, pyramids, things like that. No, you gotta kinda play with it, and like I said, cater to you. So if you have a lagging uh, body part, so let's say you have a weak chest. Your arms are solid, your shoulders are solid, you're happy with your legs, your core, but you wanna get your chest uh, caught up, pretty much. You doing chest one time a week, it's never gonna catch up because you're doing everything else one time a week too. So you wanna hit chest two times a week, three times a week to build it back up. And like I said, vary it a little bit. So maybe one day, do flat bench and uh, flat dumbbell press. The next day, do all upper chest. So do a lot of upper chest movements. The next day, do um, decline bench press and hit your lower chest, a lot of lower chest movements, flies, things like that. So you could still hit the same muscle group, but switch it up. So if you're trying to hit arms, one day do biceps, next day do triceps, break it up like that. You wanna do arms four times, four times a week like I was. One day heavy on biceps, next day light on biceps. One day heavy on triceps, next day light on triceps. So that's how I do it, that's my personal opinion. Like I said, if you're only hitting something one time a week, and it's your lagging muscle group, it's never gonna catch up. That's just the fact, that's what it is. But yeah, that's my take on it. Drop y'all's comments below. Let me know y'all's opinion, what y'all think about what I had to say. Make sure y'all click that like button. And as always, just do what you gotta do because it's that simple. T-Walk the Hawk.